Well, we are now definitely in the right place. Yep. There we are. Take Hyde's poster and future plans on the GP site. So I wonder if it... They're expanding it, I think, constantly, so... Yeah, this poster only goes up to 2012. Yeah, you got to be careful with the tides out here. There's plenty of information there. Well, it's a nice, it's nicely done up. It's I think it's been done kind of recently enough. area down there. It's lovely. Nice and kind of shape too. Do we know how long this particular walk is? I think it's about a half a mile. One way. Okay. It's about a mile overall. There and about. Uh, most of these trees above us are spruce trees. Yeah. It is a very nice area. It is so warm, guys, it's unbelievable. Very warm. Yeah. It's nice, like. So, now that we actually know where those uh, pedal car rail, rail line uh, tours uh, that's definitely one we're going to be doing as well. We've actually been looking at that for a couple of years. And I think that would be a lot of fun. It's oh yeah, we should definitely do trip. it. We should do it this year. Yeah. No telling when the rail is going to, when the railroads are going to expand and cut off their access again. Yeah. Because you can't do that on, a, on an active railway. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's, it's really, really nice down here. I can see as uh, I can see as Coquille expands that this becomes a you know a major place to come and be and recreate. Yeah. Oh yeah, it'd be lovely.
caught a glimpse of the river. I think we can actually walk down to the river right here. Yeah, that looks like Halfway. the path that goes right down because there's the river right there. I'm not sure if you guys can see it. But you can see it there, it's lovely. I don't know what the rules are concerning the river itself. Well, fishing and stuff? No, I mean like swimming and oh, like yeah. touching the river. Yeah. Each city has their own particular rules about it. Yeah. Oh, look at that out there. That's just gorgeous. Lots of, oh, cows. Yeah. Beef, milk, or mac and cheese. Huh? Either beef, milk, or mac and cheese. Beef, milk, and what do you mean? The cows. Oh. <laughs> yeah, there's a river right there. That's good. I think I saw like there's a kind of a wooden part to this as well, I think, isn't there? I thought I saw something on Facebook about it. Uh, I'm not sure. Like we're literally going right along the river there. around here are white crowned sparrows and song sparrows. What's the name of that app again? Uh, Merlin. Merlin, yeah. You want to identify birds in your area? Install the app. Merlin. Yeah, they're very quiet. We 
we see them down by the bay from time to time. Yeah, this is as far as they've got so far, but that is a nice start. Might be able to go around with there, but I don't think so. And that looks like we're going to continue on. Um, hopefully. Hopefully. Yeah, because you can see that loops back around to the river. Because we definitely have to, uh, we definitely have to respect the signs. Oh, absolutely, yeah. So that's nice to head back around. Short, but I see a lot of potential for this uh, for this walk. Oh, a huge potential. Because um, it is beautiful, as you can see there, we're going right along by the river. Yeah, it is lovely. And it's not actually that far from where we pulled in earlier. Uh, and there is a campsite up there where you can camp. And you can go fishing. And that's a nice little getaway as well, you know. But this will be spectacular when they have it completed. I could have sworn there was another, maybe it was a different place I was seeing on Facebook. Where there was like a wooden bridge or something. Or a wooden, you know, walkway over the more marshy part. And uh, identifying plant. Yeah. In this kind of weather, this is just spectacular. Yep, the flowers of bindweed. Bindweed. That is, I think it's an eagle. No. Look at the size of them. Oh yeah. Beautiful. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Alright. So Let's these are uh the bindweed, you can see, chokes off the plant by mm -hmm. covering it all up. When it covers up all the all the seeds of the native grasses, the seeds can't spring out anymore. Okay. And it just climbs all over everything, choking it out. It's little arrow-shaped leaves. So if you see it. Pull it, get rid of it. You'll notice that it's far less prevalent where the trees are and there yeah. isn't a whole lot of there isn't a whole lot of blackberry underneath the trees either. Yeah. more plants. 
that's why we're out here, you know. Yorkshire fog? I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's a blue, I think the, uh, I think the fuzzy, these fuzzy ones right here. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I think that's bluegrass. Yeah. Apparently as far as I can tell, it's bluegrass. It might be Texas bluegrass, but it's, it looks like a bluegrass to me. I don't think it's Yorkshire fog anyway, out here. Yeah. I mean, who knows, you know. Stranger things have happened. I can see at least four different types of grasses out here. Yeah. Including what I think might be meadow sweet, which is used as an extremely expensive industrial oil. Yeah. A very good alternative to petroleum products. really good start though and it's a lovely stretch like if you wanted to come down and do laps do pace walking laps oh very nice I wish know. they'd uh, I wish they had uh, you know length length posts yeah to show the distance but this I mean obviously the asphalt is new yeah it's in great condition and uh, Definitely seeing activity, deer, deer activity, because I see their uh, little spookies. <laughs> oh, you would get a lot of deer out here at night time, I'd say. When there's no one around. says apple it's not an apple <laughs> <laughs> I'd say what you'd have to do is like be up close to the leaf so I can see the leaf oh yeah but at least the oh, uh, possibly the bark at least the AI is getting information from me yeah because I submit all these pictures too yeah western cedar Right there. Western cedar. With the uh, flat leaves and then they have little uh, little ball like cones to them. They smell really nice when you cut. Oh yeah. That is definitely an alder. Lovely.
It's just really spectacular out here. Very warm. Yeah, when it, when it is hot like this, just remember to always bring water, which is plenty of water. those right there yeah I love the color of them well, that would make a spectacular bonsai oh absolutely I don't okay, know exactly what causes it to change color but it's the the early early leaves are just beautiful they are trees that we see are farmed fir trees or uh, Christmas trees. Oh yeah. There of course is Ebenhawk. Ah, oh, there's the river. There's the river, yeah. It's beautiful. Mm -hmm. Looks like it's in great shape too. Yeah, it's a little bit uh, upriver there. Uh, there is a campsite. You can camp for the night and do a bit of fishing and stuff. It would be really cool. Because it can it can kill a tree in no time. Yeah, it can strangle them. There's almost like big redwoods in it. Um. No. It has the same bark, doesn't it? It has, yeah. The bark looks very similar. It's just a bark and it reminds me of a redwood. Benches, a trash bin, keep the place nice and tidy. Yeah, this is lovely, it's just a little small picnic area. Lovely nice little solid area. Benches. Sitting at one. Yeah. There's the river just down there. Lovely. 
love that. Looks like they do encourage it. I like your writing tone too. It looks like they do encourage it, yeah. I like your writing tone. There's a tone right there. So if you need anything else, like if you've got anything, you can just run into the shop. Some wild bushes. There's a hawk there, yeah. So the crows are upset with the hawk. Yeah. And the crows are in fighting among themselves. <laughs> yeah. And the hawk Come said, on. I'm getting out of here. Ornamental plum, I think. There? The, these, I think these might be ornamental plums. Diverse little place. Oh, yeah. additions and oh yeah we'll definitely we'll definitely be keeping an eye on it and it was you know it was working me out there anyway because we got to find those the the railway thing oh, the yeah. railway cars and um, that we will definitely take the GoPro out and and um, record that that would be a whole lot of fun <laughs> all right guys uh, thanks for watching and subscribing uh, if you like the video please hit that subscribe button um, and we'll be back with more in the not too distant future we definitely have I think now three other ones lined up yep there's the lighthouse one there's um, sunset sunset bay the, the second the, the longer trip out there yeah hopefully we get hopefully we can get to uh, the actual um, big silver falls that yeah would be so lovely. there's four yeah including that there's four and of course the the pedal railway uh, that we're, yeah. we're going to be doing as well so we've got a lot of stuff uh, up and coming so all well the beautiful things of, all the beautiful things of oregon exactly yeah uh, that we want to show off so have a good one guys see you later